Hello guys, my name is Bob. Welcome to the Excel Math channel and today um, I'm going to talk about how to solve the rank of the matrix using determinant. So basically, the rank of the matrix is the order of a large non-zero square submatrix and this is an intuitive explanation. Um, so it is a little bit difficult to explain this in detail, so let me just show you how it is done. All right. Um, so let's say for example, I have this particular matrix uh, matrix A, which is a 3 by 2 matrix. So first things first, what we will always do is to solve with a smaller dimension of the square matrix, which is in this case, I will focus on the 1 by 1 um, square submatrix of A. So in matrix A, we have 6 submatrix all right. So the condition is that if let's say, okay, you know, at least one of the submatrix has non-zero value, okay, the rank is at least one. All right. So in this case itself, if we were to focus on the submatrix of A, at least one of the submatrix itself has non-zero value. So the rank is at least one. So the next thing that we will focus on is the um, 2 by 2 square submatrix of A. So in this case, we have two two by two submatrix and the condition is that at least okay one of the submatrix has determinant which is not equal to zero and hence we can conclude that the rank is no, two, and the rank is at most two because of the limitation of this column and row. So in order to determine, okay, whether is it of rank two, which means that we have to use the determinant um, to determine whether or not, okay, the submatrix has, you know, determinant not equals to zero. All right. So if the submatrix has determinant not equals to zero, at least one of them, um, the rank is at least two. So we have two submatrix, which is the first one is 4, 3, negative 8, and negative 6. The second one is uh, negative 8, negative 6, 16, and 12. So we evaluate the determinant of these two submatrix. All right, let me just write down here. So the determinant of the first submatrix is uh, 4, negative, no, negative 6, minus, minus negative 8. Um, 3 and this gives me 0. How about the second submatrix which is negative 8, negative 6, 16 and 12. So we will just take negative 8 times 12 minus 16 times negative 6 and this gives me 0 as well. So the problem right now is that my out of the two 2 by 2 square submatrix of A, none of them has a determinant of non-zero so which means that my rank cannot be 2 and hence therefore my rank is at most 1 right because 1 is the order of the large non-zero square submatrix all right I hope this uh, video is clear enough to explain about the rank of the matrix. And if you guys do have any problems, I do foresee that you guys have problems, do comment in the comment section below and I will try and help to rectify. All right, thank you guys for tuning into this video and I'll see you in the next video.